Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to another video. I hope you guys are well. I hope you guys have had a great week. I have not, not to throw a pity party, but it's been a stressful week yet again. I just feel like I'm non-stop. And when I do stop, I feel like my brain can't stop. So I'm literally always constantly thinking, always constantly stressed. And I genuinely just need a holiday. Like, I just feel like I'm a mum. Of like seven kids right now just trying to juggle everything try like they have to do in life and look after other people and i can't I'm, like, I'm struggling to look after myself at this point like i used to be one of those people that could never chill in the afternoons or the evenings like i'd always have to be busy doing something because like watching tv just got boring and just sitting still but oh my god all i want to do all day every day is just be a slug and i can't because i have things to do but like i'm just mentally physically emotionally exhausted and like i'm not trying to throw a pity party but i know it's all going to come tumbling down at one point and i know i need to start taking care of myself but you know when like i don't know if anyone else gets this as well but i feel like sometimes when i feel like i'm taking care of myself people are going to judge me because i'm doing a lot less than i normally do and they're going to be like what the hell is she doing she's not doing like what she normally does and i'm like if i don't just have a break <laughs> i'm gonna break you know but other than that, guys, I'm, like, so fine. I'm just extremely tired. And I just need a holiday, honestly. And then I need a holiday that I never come back here to. Like, I need a holiday and then I just go live my life wherever that is. You know? Something happens. It's like a novel where, oh, okay, yeah, sure, I'll be a waitress. Oh, yeah, sure, I'll end up running the cafe. Sure, I'll just end up having the time of my life and never leaving. Okay, I'll do it. You don't have to tempt me, I'll do it. Like, sign me up. Where's the where's the notepad? I'll signature it, mate. Anywho, anywho. Me waffling as always. If you can hear the dishwasher in the background, I'm sorry, I didn't put it on. You know, <sighs> my brain's just not working. It probably isn't going to be the most uplifting cash stuffing video you've ever seen because I don't know if you, I've mentioned, but I'm really tired. <laughs> but um, I will try my best. There's one more thing. Oh, yeah. I also might um have to change up the setup because just where i'm doing it right now isn't really feasible i kind of have to when people are out the house i kind of have to rush to do it and i don't feel i feel a lot of stress starting this and then stress having to finish it before people get back or people wake up um because i do it in the kitchen because um i don't have a room here like i, I live i don't know if i've mentioned this either but I live with my boyfriend um but yeah i live with my boyfriend and because I live with his family, I don't have, like, a room to myself, and he loves to sleep in until 1pm, so, like, I can't film in there, because then everyone's back, and it's, I'm not gonna lie, guys, it's a lot of stress, I feel like at the moment, my life is so stressful that, like, stress is kind of taking over my enjoyment, um, again, not a pity party, just telling you how my week's been, so, I think the setup's gonna change, the day I the time I upload is gonna change. Honestly, guys, when I get some brain cells, I will sort it all out. Um, but if you see it change, just know I pre-warned you. I guess we're missing something as well. We're missing our friend to like spice it up. Yeah, you can go there. I guess we're a bit in the way. But what was I gonna say? What was I gonna say? Oh yeah, also this was my boyfriend's jumper, and look, like, what the hell? If I'm yeah if you see me fiddling with this jeans it's just huge man it's just huge okay let's start with the cash stuffing 20 oh, well messed up there it is it's always at the start isn't it it's always at the start 20 40 60 80 100 i feel like this thing's actually gonna get on my nerves <laughs> maybe we have to put you here because you're you're kind of in the way there i mean i could put you i can't really see oh look at that beautiful Yep, that'll do. 10, 20, 30. 5.45, 50. 1.50. Now, when I did this, when I took this out of the bank, I didn't go to the bank, I went to the post office. I hadn't actually decided what denominations were going to go in what categories. So I kind of just had to guess what money I thought I'd want out. It's worked out. It has worked out. Also, ignore these two nails. Okay. Um, and this one. Basically, I'm growing up my nails. Don't know if you guys can see. 
I'm sorry, they're actually so good for me. I'm growing up my nails, but during when I started uni work or something stressful, I used to bite my nails. So now I just bite my nail varnish off. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's kind of ugly. I did think about honestly, guys, I did think about like taking the nail varnish off, and then I thought I actually just can't be bothered. Like I need people to see the real me, and this is the real me, you know. Anyway, shut up, love. Okay, so car insurance today is gonna get twenty. 22 does anyone else have those words where like you say a word i'm gonna have to bring myself here you say a word and then it immediately breaks out in song anyone else because i do that a lot like if you say 20 or 22 it's it's you have to sing 22 you know not a swifty not a hater either don't get it confused but oh mate i just dropped it on the floor I don't think I need that for the rest of the video anyway, so it can stay there. So, car insurance now has... Did I say insurance? Mm, insurance, insurance. Car insurance now has 175 in the bank. But this is where it gets tough. <laughs> I just didn't like this because I can't do the math right now. 175 in the bank, 180, 200, 220, 240. And before I go on, guys, guess what? I am really sorry. I do feel a bit bummy today. So, like, I feel like I'm not giving in the energy and the good vibes I normally do. So... Apologies for that. But it just reminded me with my tracker that... Sorry, it just got a lean everywhere. I'm sorry if you see my face. It's not looking great. I have made these. Um, these are like a um, blank canvas tracker, kind of, where like I don't have the goal, the date, yada, yada, yada. So I've made quite a few of these and I just need to take pictures and put them on Etsy. But like, if anyone sells things on Etsy... Please, can you just give me advice or give me a pep talk that, like, the pictures don't need to be perfect? Because I'm really getting in my head that, like, I can't take good pictures of these that, like, look professional. And it's making me just feel a bit poop scoop. Um, if you can't tell, I'm not having a great week. <laughs> um, again, no pity party. It, it happens. Like, it will literally be fine. I, I will be fine and it will be fine. But I really take pictures of these. But, like, I just can't get the angle. And they're glossy. So I don't want them to be light on. And I just don't know how to take them. And they're really... It's really frustrating me, honestly. So, guys, can you either just give me a pep talk that, like, the pictures don't need to be perfect. Like, just put them up there. Or can you give me hints and tips on how to take good pictures? That is an anomaly. Let me just take that one out. Um, yeah, I have, like, loads. I've got, like, I, I mean, I'll show you now if you want. So I've got emergency fund, pet care... Christmas, debt, car insurance, TV license, water, electricity, gas. This one's like a do-it-yourself. So, like, you can write whatever you want on top, whatever your goal is, you know. Like, you can just name it. Because there's definitely things I'm going to miss out that people are going to want to save for. And I just thought I'd make a cute one. Rainy day, therapy, travel, holiday, vehicle maintenance, car tax, health, and we're back to emergency funds. So I've made loads. And I, I really want to upload them. But like I'm just kicking myself. Because I can't get great pictures. There it goes again. Um, So please. just I just need a pep talk guys. And I need this dishwasher to hush hush. Because that is actually really disrespectful. Car tax. We're going we're gonna to talk through it. Car tax is getting 10. And oh my god we're almost done. I tried to look up when my car tax was due. Because I know it's due in March. But I didn't know if you could like repay it um but like when i did that it was like what document have you had in the post it's like a v5 or something and like if you don't basically if you don't have like a document telling you you need to pay car tax it's like you can't actually pay it and then i was like shit where's where's that letter going to because i moved recently also somebody asked me um aesthetic budgets i have an instagram now we were talking on instagram and she asked me what lessex budget stands for and i realized like i've never actually told you so lessex stands for london and essex i grew up in london my whole life like i was born there i lived there until i was 22 and then my mum decided to move which was actually really rude like move to fuck nowhere um my mum decided to move to suffolk and then i met my boyfriend and he lives in essex and i live with him so i went from london to essex so i just merged the two together because honestly i couldn't think of another adjective name i didn't want to use my name i don't know why i'm a bit skeptical sometimes I don't know. I just need to go over myself. But um, yeah, so Lessex just means London, Essex, because it's where I'm from and where I am now. That makes sense. 
control. <laughs> um, but yeah, so it's almost done. My mum's just gonna get my letter for my tax and then she's just gonna have to send it to me. It's just a bit of a pain in the ass really. I should really change my dress, but anywho. So in car tax now we have 75, 85, 95, 105, 110. Yes, I nailed that. I know that because I can see I only got £20 left. I've only got £20 left and then I'm done. Which is lovely because that means I'm going to be finished like mid-March. Ah! Get him, get him, get him. Also, just to say with these trackers, they are like colour coordinated on the back as well. So, it's really cute. I'm also going to think, I think what I'm just going to do is I'm going to ask if you want it like this. Or I did some for my aunt and I left like an inch gap and hole punched it. Because she does hers digitally, so like she doesn't actually have wallets, she just wants to track. So I might offer that as well. Um, probably will. I just need to like explain that. Okay, holiday 2k24. Thank you. Is obviously getting 25. Obviously. And I remember one of you commented, I'm so sorry, I really forgot your name. But like I was like debating whether to do my 2k25 um holidays or like use that money a bit more wisely uh more wisely and one of you was like no it's fine you'll get your holiday wrong pen they're like you're gonna get that holiday don't worry which was really cute i think i might have to go down to like 10 pound a week instead of 20 just for myself and to actually have money to spend um but that was really sweet of them saying that so thank you and i'm also i should be doing a cash condensing for the end of january very soon um maybe midweek it might be up on thursday because i'm not at uni on wednesday so hopefully i can film then but holiday 2k24 has got 10 75 do it like this i can't do the math 180 220 45 55 so 255 and you know what yes this works out yes 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 so i think i owe my friend like 240 pounds so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna cash condense this in the video and then send the money to her and then basically one of my holidays is literally already like i've already paid for it so I, that's not something i need to stress out for i really don't like owing people money so like the quicker i can give them back the better my other group of friends try wanted to go on a holiday and i was like i literally don't have the funds guys like i don't and they're like why and i had to explain to them i was like babes i got i got my own bills like i might not have a house but i got to pay my car insurance i got to pay my car tax i got to pay for birthdays you know i forgot to mention that they were like two weeks late and i'd already booked holiday with my other friends and they were like yeah and then i said birthdays and they were like oh just tell your family i'm sure they'd rather you go on holiday than them get a birthday present and i was just thinking you don't know my family they want a birthday present bitch they don't care about my holiday anywho vehicle maintenance is getting nothing travel is getting nothing which is getting neglected because i literally went um where did i go i went up london to eat out on friday and it was like 10 pounds for the train so i'm kind of in debt to myself i did have some extra money um that i do have savings so I, sometimes i do have to dip in that which isn't great but like i'm lucky i have that um it's like my small emergency fund that i had before i started um cash stuffing but i just i don't earn enough i don't and i say earn like i actually earn any money therapy's getting nothing to holidays 2k25 like i said i think i might have to take this down to like 10 pounds because as excited as i am for it it's getting 20 today i i need to prioritize the now instead of the the future to be honest because the now is what i do be living in I'm going to change this because I feel like I've just used the wrong pen again. Um, and you never know, by like January next year, I might actually have a job. Don't hold your breath. <laughs> but I might actually have a job. But in 2K25 holidays, it's 20, 40, 60, 80. So I think, yeah, I think starting February, I might take this down to 10. Because I think in the, on holidays like that as well, when it's like over a grand, they know that like not a lot of people have the grand up front. So you can pay monthly. So worst comes to worst, that will happen. But... It's just not ideal. I, like I said, like, I don't, like, unless it's a direct debit that, like, has to happen every month. Like, the phone bill, something else. I just don't, like, owe people money. I want it to be upfront, you know? Medical's getting nothing. Emergency funds get nothing. And buffers getting nothing. Because I really feel like I'm just not giving you entertainment today. And it's kind of getting on my nerves. But I also can't force it because <laughs> I just can't force being happy when I'm not. 
or excited. Not that I'm not happy, but like energetic when I'm not, you know? I literally rolled out of bed half an hour ago. Had to set this up. <sighs> Had to talk to myself, like, you can do this, gal. You can do this. And here we are. Okie dokes. So, in events, date night's getting nothing. Because it's not my date night next week, so that's lovely. Okay, nothing. That's fully funded. That's ages away. Mm, not ages away, but you know. Fully funded. Okay, Easter is going to get five. Do you know what I've also seen as well? Um, I don't know why, but since having an Instagram, I will tag it here. Like, loads of people have been following me, and I love that. But, like, I'm shocked by the talent in this community. Like, absolutely shocked. And it makes me feel like an amateur. Because I was sitting there thinking, like, yeah, I'll sell my stuff. And I'm looking at everyone else's, and I'm like, well then. Guess I won't be getting any customers. Because, guys, honestly... You guys do the most beautiful stuff. Cash but cute. Uh, phenomenal. Phenomenal. I saw their Instagram and I watched their video for the first time last week. And I was like, are you joking me? Someone has actually made this beautiful tracker. So I decided by like, next year <clears throat> or like for the rest of the year, I might get trackers for th things like Valentine's Day, Easter, Mother's Day. Because it just makes it more fun, doesn't it? It just makes it more fun. So shout out to everyone who actually makes like really cute saving challenges. Or just just saving challenges in general. They're all really cute. But like shout out to everyone who makes them because you guys are talented talented and it it's sickening and it shocks me sorry i was making sure i had enough 20s um but just shout out to everyone honestly who makes their own stuff because what the hell it's incredible but okay i put i think i put five pounds in easter so easter now has 5 10 15 20 25 and i i, I budgeted 40 pound for easter but realistically i really don't think i'm going to do it if i spend like 10 pounds on my boyfriend and then like a six pound easter egg on my sister and then maybe on my other sister and then on my niece that's not gonna be 40 pounds oh well save them sorry and then i can just use it for something else to be honest <clears throat> sorry i'm like choking right now <laughs> on myself my own you know shut up i'm just gonna shut up because you know i'm just waffling um birthdays is also gonna get 10 i'm a bit umming and ahhing as well about these birthdays it's got 10 20 30 i don't know i think it's because it's the end of january and these are for march and i don't really know what's happening um alas that is this binder dumb um i was gonna say something yeah i don't know if anyone else gets this because i literally rolled out of bed like half an hour ago i feel like my voice is so deep and groggy so forgive me for that as well Okay, so now we're on to my binder, guys. I'm sorry this isn't, like, the most eventful ever. Um, but we're almost done. So fuel is going to get 20. I will fill up today when I go food shopping. Personal is going to get 10 because I'm always going to get some food somewhere. Like, just a little snack. Being back at uni makes me just hungry and being bored makes me hungry too. So miscellaneous isn't going to get anything. And then I have two tampa notes and they're going to go in eating out because... Last week I spent this 50, so that's, it's gotta go. It's gotta go. And now eating out only has 10, and I think I'm, I'm not gonna go out to eat next week because your girl doesn't have the funds. But then the week after, I think I'm seeing some friends and we're gonna go eat out there. And then a lot of these, I have to take money out of. Guys, seeing clothes, this is a bit TMI, but this guy mentioned that I had to get my bra sizing done, that I really had really huge boobs, I'm not trying to show off, it's actually a curse, not a blessing. And for the first time in months, I actually found bras that were comfy and fit. Not gonna lie, it was £20 for one bra, which was horrific, and I haven't taken the money out of here, um, but I will do later. But guys, I found them. Mm, 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 mm. I don't think people understand also the rest of it is just not getting anything so um people don't understand like people i feel like big boobs are like not fetishized that's the wrong word but like they're like wow you have really big boobs i can't wear anything nice okay i get ugly granny bras i can never go free the nipple i'm always in underwire it's not a comfy life if you have small boobs or boobs that are like a medium size Please just be thankful right now. Say a prayer and say thank you, God, for giving me these beautiful boobs. I do love my boobs. They're great. They're soft. They're lovely. My boyfriend likes them. 10 out of 10. But Jesus Christ, they're fucking annoying at times, man. Why are they so expensive? Why are they so big? Like, come on. I can't show you my boobs right now. But, and I know this is a bit of a weird conversation. But also, 
what the hell? God, you haven't done me any favours. I don't believe. If I did, I would have cursed you because... What a horrible boob life you've given me. Horrible. But you know, thankful to, to be alive. Anywho, changing the topic. Now I want to change. And look at all this change. Mm -mm -mm. Most of it... Obviously, I did some spending. I've done a lot of digital spending today. Um, this week, even. And I don't... Oh, I'm using my phone to record. So hopefully next um, week when I use my boyfriend's phone because his phone's so much nicer to record um i can show you what i do but i do have a digital like penny savings challenge i'll explain that all next time but um yeah all of this is from obviously when i spent cash and also um while i was cleaning up the house there was a little change and well my boyfriend was cleaning up the house actually that was such a fat lie um my boyfriend cleaned up the house and he was like i found all this change like here have it because he was like and he literally was like i know you like the weird things like saving pennies and i was looking at him i was like when these pennies buy your birthday present, they're not going to be weird then, are they? But yeah, so we've actually got loads of change. Unfortunately, we don't have any um, pound coins and we're so close. But it's okay. It is a-okay. Okay, so let's do the 50-50 saving challenge. Um, I've got one, two. I've got two 50p's. I think I'm going to change this layout as well, guys. I know I said that last time. Wrong one. <laughs> I know I said that last time, but... I'm just, there's so much going on in my head. There might not be a lot going on physically, mentally, exhausted. Absolutely exhausted, thinking 24-7. I think this is the wrong pen. Actually, no, this one's going to be the right one. Um, but I don't know. I don't think I'm going to sell these. I don't know. I'll think about it. Two? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I've got a saying because I'm just chatting a load of rubbish, to be honest with you um yep forgot i thing. okay so in for a penny jeez we have got loads here now this time i might actually need the calculator it was so funny re-watching my video to edit it um last week when i got out the calculator and i just thought to myself like what did i have 48p i was like what did you get that calculator for for 48p nice nice to be optimistic and i couldn't even think yesterday either yesterday last week video is almost over guys <laughs> it's almost over okay so today we've got 20 40 60 80 one pound one pound 10 20 30 40 60 two four six one pound 46 okay i am gonna get my health creator out okay so Yes, one pound sixty-four. Even let me just count that off camera. Yeah. Okay. So we've got one pound forty-six. Beautiful. I did manage to do that right. Okay. So is everything in shot? Yeah, near enough. Near enough. So I'm gonna take off ninety-six p. So minus zero point nine six. Sixty-eight. Yeah, of course it's. Sorry, I was just trying to find it. So we need to do 69 96 even <laughs> 96 and 68 okay so all that is in there and then so what should we do say what should we say this one and then for 68p we will do this one yeah fair enough Oh my god, in a bright red. Nice. Nice. I'm actually going to do this for this one because we've got a lot of reds down here anyway. And I think I'm going to change this up and actually do circles because I decided I was trying to be quirky. I was trying to be different with like the oblongs. But it's honestly, it triggers me when I see it because it's absolutely horrific. <laughs> it's not horrific, I'm joking. But like, I was trying to do something and I was like, you know what? Sometimes less is more. So let's do less instead of more. I'm glad we got to do two and some of the bigger numbers today, so that is good. Um, again, it's taken a while, but that is totally fine. Um, it's looking cute, though. And then nothing for the £5 challenge. Just, you know, these are cute. This is what I meant as well by, like, um, hole punch the, the trackers. So, um, like, you could actually just put them in like this instead of having them in um, a wallet. 
but guys with that that is the end of my video this is like the quickest video i've ever done she says 25 minutes in i'm sorry i was a bit all over the place and you know i was a bit you know debbie down off but like that happens in life you know i'm i'm sorry but i can't I can't fake being the most ecstatic when I genuinely feel like I need to like sleep for a year just to feel a tiny bit more energised. <laughs> but hopefully next week's a better week. I don't have any exams um, and essays due for a couple of weeks. So I'm going to take next week easy. Uh, give myself a break, you know, do work here and there, but like not stress. Hopefully post these um, trackers because, you know, I keep beating myself up about that. But guys, if any of you have like a stress... If any of you have had a stressful year, a stressful week so far, a stressful day, it's Monday tomorrow, slash whenever I upload this. <laughs> it's it's Monday, it's a new week, and it's a new day tomorrow. We just need to take a moment and just realise that we cannot pour from an empty cup. That's what I think. Whenever I think about like taking care of myself, I just think, I cannot pour from an empty cup. If I don't take care of myself, chances are I will like get aggy and like have a go at my boyfriend over something that he hasn't even done just because I'm frustrated. Like I have to take care of myself to be the best person for other people and to just be on top of things. So guys, saying that, please look after yourselves and I will do the same. And hopefully next week I can come back a bit more, mm, 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 you know, and I have a good story to tell you or like, I'm just like, I'm doing great. And I hope you guys will come back next week if you're feeling bad and feeling great. And if you had a lovely week, I'm jealous of you. And I hope you have an even better one next week, okay? I hope you have the best week yet. Because we're going into February. And that is the, the month of love. <laughs> we'll talk about all that stuff next week, maybe. Or whenever Valentine's Day decides to come around. But other than that, guys, I am waffling. But thank you so much for watching, everyone. I'm t I think I'm nine subscribers away from 200 so that's exciting so if you watch this video and you haven't subscribed and you enjoyed it even though it wasn't the best maybe watch another one of mine and please think about subscribing please give it a like give it a comment if you fancy check out my Instagram because I might be posting stuff there and I posted the wallets I sent Sally budgets um or sales budget sorry for the giveaway so give that a little look and yeah I'm just waffling as per usual, guys. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have a lovely week. Take care of yourself. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye, guys.